All right, hello everybody and welcome to the channel. As usual, my name is of course Constantine and today we're about to check out a brand new game called Savior Less. Uh, now, I had my hands on this game uh, for a couple of days here. Uh, I just got a chance here to check it out and uh, I gotta tell you guys, this one's gonna be a very, very special one as I always, always try to bring you guys on this channel some of the best indie games out there and uh this one is definitely going to be one of them so without further ado guys before we jump right in just want to take a quick moment here to thank the publisher for providing a review copy to share the game with you all if you guys really like what you see here and want to grab the game for yourselves links down below in the description as i always provide for all the games that i feature on this channel and without further ado let us uh start a tale let's do this Now, one thing that actually captured my attention about this game is, as you guys can see, the art style. I mean, look at how beautiful this game looks. Hand-drawn and everything, it just looks like an animation. Uncle, this is the fifth time we've made me repeat the same thing. Please, Len, focus and explain the first rule to us again. A good narrator will never allow the protagonist to achieve his goals. Exactly. We need narrators and the ones who control the protagonist, not doing so will be equivalent to losing control of the, narr the narration. If a story happens exactly as it is written, well, what will happen? Well, then no narrator will be needed. Correct, Arimbo. And since you seem so willing, tell us a bit about the second rule. Well, a good narrator will never control the several protagonists within the same story. Very good. Congratulations to both of you. Although I think that is enough lessons for today. We better start with the narration because today I feel a bit tired and I don't want to fall asleep in the middle of the story. Are you both ready? I almost am. Mm, whenever you want, Uncle Tobia Tobias. Well, this is the story of a boy named Anter and his desire to reach a wondrous land known as the Smiling Island. A forgotten and distant place to which only the radiant Huron still remembers the way. Ah oh, man, I'm also loving the art style here. I'm always down to uh, new games, especially when they look this good and they do have a really, really lovely story to them. At this rate, I'll never catch up with the damned hero. Alright, hold up. I'm guessing the damned hero he's talking about, it's that bird, right? That flew off. And of course, I'm definitely not going that way. Ah oh man, but this is so gorgeous. Look at this. This is such a beautiful world. Sanctuary of the Herons. Now, when I do discover a game such as this one, for example, I don't really like uh, looking too much into it. I don't really like looking at too many gameplays of it just because I want to keep my experience through the adventure. here is like super, super fresh. So I've only seen a little bit of this game and um, that's about it. Trespassing is strictly forbidden. Only hunters that allow in this area. Hmm. I guess I'm not a hunter. So let's see what's going to happen here. And what I love about this game is that it's also going to have a little bit of puzzling that we're going to have to do. So this is going to be a very special one. This looks like a page from a book. Hmm. The boy activated the lever, and then a strange page appeared flooring before his eyes. What a coincidence! This text describes exactly the same thing that I just did. <laughs> oh man. Yeah, I have a feeling these pages that we're going to be getting uh, are going to be describing basically what we're going to be doing. Oh, what the heck? I can see that you are not going to make it easy for me to reach the Smiling Islands. Hmm. Yeah, it's kind of like trying to stay away from me for some reason. Uh, hold up, let me activate this one as well. Why am I dropping these things? Oh, and I'm noticing that the page that I just collected is all the way to the bottom left of the corner of the uh, screen here. So I gotta find... How many is that? Uh, four more. So that's gonna drop another one. Why do I keep on dropping these? What's the point of it? Oh shoot, almost missed that up. Oh, that one's a page. That's the point of them. Okay, okay, okay. Let's click the second page then. There we 
go. How do you uh, how do you read these pages? It doesn't look like I can press anything to read them. Yeah, it doesn't look like I can press anything to read them. Ooh, we also have the ability to kind of like climb up like in Prince of Persia. Nice. Hanging out to the ledge and then pulling ourselves up. Love it. Uh, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Before I go down, there's also a path to go up. Hmm. But there's no pages here. Actually, hold up. I got a... Ooh, is that like a key? Yeah, it looks like a key down there. Hold up, let me go back. I'm gonna have to do a little bit of a... Uh, nobody. I'm gonna have to do a little bit of a... Uh, key collecting here. This is so cool. Loving the art style. A key. I guess there must be a door nearby. I guess there will. Oh, never mind. So that is the door that I needed. I was actually expecting the door to be a door, but this is more like a, uh, a gate. All right. Oh my god. So if he does push me, he's gonna push me all the way back. Oh, that was so close. No! Uh, are you kidding me? I think I'm about to uh, duck so that I do not get pushed back by the blowback here. Oh, this is so cool. So cool. Okay, 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 okay. Go, go, go. And walk slowly, buddy. Do not get up. Please do not get up. Okay, go back. Oh, am I supposed to drop that cage on its head? Seriously? Hopefully that's not gonna happen. I just want to scare it off. There we go. Sneak and scare away the glowing heron. Right, got it. Another key. Registry. Wait, what? Capture 625. Eliminated 327. Wait, what? X collected 936. No hunters have been seen the specimen. Don't mention the dead herons to Nanto. Oh, so they're killing the uh, the poor creatures. Now I understand why that heron has been so unfriendly since I got here. Yeah, he thinks that I want to kill it, I guess, or get his babies or eggs. I wouldn't want any humans around either. Dang it. Okay. That makes sense. Can I climb on top of this? Yes, we can. Jump! Okay, that's not gonna work. Never mind. Yeah, apparently these hunters are hunting down the herons. Oh, that is so cool. Oh, man, I love this. I love it that it has puzzles we gotta solve and everything. It's really cool. Combined with the art style, really special. And there's also kind of like small herons as well. That uh, squeak at us when they see us. Oh gosh, no, not this again. Hmm. Well, that's fine because I do see a map piece over there. I have no clue how to get to it, to be honest. I'm gonna have to find a different way. Hold up. Hey, another map piece. Perfect. So that's one. Get it and get out of there. Nice. Okay. Got it. Alright. Go back here. Before I'm going to chat with that guy, I got to get me one more piece over here that I know of. Let's try to figure out how to get this one because I do not want to fall down. Can I actually climb on that ladder I want there? Oh, gosh. Oh, my. Oh, dang it, dude. How do you get this one without falling down? No. Dang it. 
Thank it. How do you... Oh, never mind. That's how you do it. Okay, okay, okay. We got it. We got it. Uh, I was not expecting that. So we need one more piece. And we should be good. Let me chat with this dude first. Maybe he has the other piece. Hi, my name is The Sane, and I'm something of an amateur chronicler. My greatest aspiration is recording these pages, the adventures of some brave protagonists like you. Someone capable of facing the greatest obstacles in order to reach the smiling island to become a savior. Uh, how do you know all that? Well, Anter, no self-respecting chronicle ignores the motivations of his protagonist. That's why I followed in with the footsteps carefully writing down every detail in this book. Unfortunately, some pages have ended up getting lost. If you could find them all, I could give you the content of this chest. You haven't found all the missing pages. You need one more. Without the missing pages, your story will always remain unfinished. I get it. Okay, 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 hold up. I think I know where I'm going to be able to find the last one. And I think that the last one is actually going to be maybe on top of this tower. It has to be here. Because I'm pretty sure I haven't missed any other ones. Yep, there we go. And we got the key. I can use whatever this is. Oh, there's a page. Ah, now I actually got all the pages. Never mind. Man, but I'm absolutely loving the world. It's so cool. Ruben's notes. After learning of Nento's latest plans, I have decided to escape. Please, Davier, wait before raising the alert about my absence so I can get away safely. Your friend, Rubens. P.S. Destroy this note as soon as you read it. Hmm. I guess he never did. Or maybe he never read it? But anyway, now that I got myself all the notes, uh, let me try to make my way to uh, this fella. And see if I'm going to be able to read the entire story and also see what's inside the chest. Thanks for bringing me all the missing pages. The chest is open. You can now take its contents. Uh, the vacuous memory of the childhood love. Huh. Collect the withered flower in the sanctuary of the harems. Hmm. Enter, you already have the content of the chest. You still have a long way to go in your story. So I also have a lot to write. Uh, I also noticed that I do not have uh, the pages anymore, right? On the uh, bottom left corner. So I guess we got it. Maybe we're going to get more in the next chapter. Oh no, not this again. Oh, it's going to trigger all of them. I got to go. What? Jesus. No, 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 no. Come on, buddy. That is so cool. Good job. Run, enter. Oh, God. And I guess we got it. Yeah, of course the heron is not going to trust me. Because uh, humans have chased them off. They ain't no longer going to trust nobody. No matter who I am. Oh, my God. Not this again. Stop. I don't want to hurt you. I don't really know exactly what I'm doing here, but I most of it don't want to hurt you. Oh, no, 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 no. Almost messed up there. Come on, buddy. We got this. Almost there, almost there. And open up the gates. Oh, that is cool. Uncle, aren't you bored of always telling us the same old story? It's true. What good is a story in which the protagonist never achieves his goals? Uh, the profound ignorance of our questions only confirms to me that you are not yet ready to serve as narrators. Do you have any ideas of what would happen if this story came to, the an end? came to an end? Well, I guess we could tell a story where the protagonist does manage to uh, become the savior. I will choose someone better than Anter. Hmm. Kids, that's not how it works for us. There will never be another story, not another protagonist. Each narrator is tied for life for a specific story, his story, and that is how the destiny of both is forever intertwined. What a bummer. 
So we are doomed to repeat the same answer story over and over and over again? That sounds so boring. All right, I guess uh, we made it to the uh, second chapter. And I do see that now we have a bunch of new pages that we got to collect. Hunter's Cave. Oh, man, it's such a, such a special uh, adventure. It's really, really pretty. Absolutely loving the art style. All right, I do see some ladders over there, but I have no clue how to jump and get to that. Can I release this bird? Yeah. Nope. What the heck? Hey, there's the first page. I knew it. Okay, let's grab it. Wait, 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 wait. Grab it. There we go. I wish I could actually read these pages that I'm collecting, to be honest. I would absolutely love it if I could read it. Hmm. I wonder what's the point of uh, me releasing those worms. So these are worm eggs, right? Yeah, look at that. Every single time I step into them, it's activating some sort of a... Oh my god. You can also step on them. What the heck? Do not like that. Oh, what the heck is that? Have you come to help us? Help us. Help you. Uh, what is happening? We must hurry up before it's too late. Nanto and his group are still trapped at the bottom of the cave. H hurry up before it's... uh. Oh, what the... What is that? This doesn't look good at all. Um, okay, so this game is gonna have enemies for us. What the heck? Joshua's Revenge. Kill the worm inside the hunter's cave. What was that? That was so creepy. Oh, man, this game is beautiful, though. Oh, gosh, another one. Yeah, I most definitely have to stay away from them. And I'm also going to have to give it up this one. There we go. Oh my god. Jesus Christ. <laughs> um um Oh shoot. That was close. That was very very close. Dang it, I'm messing up so much. Okay, hold up, hold up, hold up. Okay, there we go. There's the first one. Perfect, we got rid of that one. Jesus Christ. I actually love that the game doesn't really have combat. Uh, I do have to stay away from enemies here, but... uh, You do that by actually solving puzzles, which is awesome. Alright, there we go. Got rid of all these crazy looking bugs. Come on. Rules for taking care of the herons. Transport the eggs to the incubation panels. Only feed herons the designated life foods. Provide rigorous maintenance of the heating system. Hmm. The heck? Okay, okay, hold up, hold up. I gotta do this first. And then this. Jesus Christ. <laughs> oh, man. Get out of here. Uh, somehow I gotta open this up to get myself another map. You can also pull it, that's great. 
Meaning I'm gonna have to go back once I'm gonna open up the door there. And I'm gonna be guessing that lever is gonna be the one that I need, right? Hopefully. Hmm. Can I really interact with, uh, these birds? Oh gosh. Okay, let me go back, because I'm pretty sure the map is now going to be collectible. Yes! Perfect. Alright, it's going to be the second one. I'm saying map pieces, but no, these are not map pieces, these are pages of uh, a journal. I don't think I even need this anymore. Uh, never mind. I was wrong. I was very, very wrong. Oh my god, not this again. I think I gotta do... This? Oh gosh. Oh my gosh. Thank God. I didn't have to deal with them. Oh no, 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 uh, Are you kidding me, game? Well, think of it, it's not that uh, difficult to actually run away from them. Oh, Jesus. Jesus. <laughs> uh... What the heck? Hey! Get... Get out of here. Luckily, someone has heard my call. Quick, I don't think Nento and the Hunters can resist the worm's attack much longer. Worms? I do not know what you are talking about. First, we suffer from a horrible infection that wiped out more than half of our group. And then, as if I... W and, and then, as if it was a curse, the worms began to grow excessively until everyone got out of control. You know, maybe it would be the best if you escape from this cave. From what you tell me, this seems to be a pretty dangerous place. I can't. First, I got away from my father to come back with help. His name is uh, Joshua. It's a coincidence that you didn't meet him on your way here. In any case, you should try to help our leader Nento. Surely it would allow you to join our group so you could reach the smiling island and become an immortal savior in the process. Hmm. Okay. Oh my god! Oh, there's a sword. Am I going to be able to use that, I wonder? Ah, uh, I know what I got to do. <laughs> I know exactly what I got to do. Yep, there we go. Can I grab the sword? No. A, a map piece. Perfect. Alright, we got three of them so far. Just need to find two. Oh my god. I really don't like the look of this place. What the heck? Rules for life food maintenance. It is strictly prohibited to stand on the soil. Feed the worms only with discarded chicks. Specimens with gigantism must be eliminated. What the heck? Gigantism. From what I see, this Neto guy is quite like writing rules. <laughs> yeah, that is very, very true. And I have a feeling this Neto guy is going to be probably poisoned or something like that. And he's going to be a boss. What the hell? Could these be the giant worms the hunter was telling me it was telling me about? Oh gosh. Oh, what? I didn't even see that one. Thank it. Oh, my God. Oh, 
Na 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 na. What's up, buddy? Oh gosh. Oh, we're good. Oh, I gotta make it hit it again. Cause I need that key. There we go. Oh shoot. No 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 no. This is not that type of platform where you can actually jump through the platforms. You always have to kind of like break them or find a way across. Wait, can I use this? Oh, never mind. Uh, I have a bad thing about this. I mean, it's not that bad. Oh my, oh, almost stepped off. Almost, almost spit, stepped off there. Oh, what the? Oh, gosh dang it. Hey, hit it here. Hit it here. Oh, my God. It almost, almost had me. Oh, no. It's going to get me here. It's not going to get me. Never mind. All right. Let's keep it going. Perfect. It's gonna drop that thing, come on. I think we are done. Okay. What about these tiny worms? They haven't really been doing much. Oh, so many worms, look at that. I don't know if I can climb up there. They're gonna have to find a way. Rules for conservation of the eggs. If a radiant heron chick hatches, report immediately. Discard grayish eggs due to the risk of a worm infection. Set aside discarded chicks in the live feeding uh, area. It seems that this entire place was designed to uh, conceive a radiant heron in captivity. How foolish. Yeah, I'm guessing there's a heron that keeps on uh, squealing at me whenever I'm trying to get closer to it. And I'm pretty sure I need this in order to collect that chest at the top. So let's just do that. Oh, shoot. Hey, another map piece. Perfect. I just need to find one more. Really enjoying the uh, adventure so far. Always absolutely in love with these type of games, and whenever I find them, I'm just super, super happy. Because coming, ac coming across these indie gems, it's definitely not that easy. There's so many games out there. You always have to find, uh, or more like look for the best. Am I supposed to jump up there? No, I don't think so. Never mind. I just gotta find one more of these uh, pages for the book, and we should be good. Oh my god, this looks like a boss battle. They're all dead. Even Nento, our great leader. Because of those damn worms, we'll never make it to the Smiling Island. I will have died together with my compatriots instead of ru running away like a coward. We too must die alongside them. What? What the heck, dude? What are you doing? Wait a minute. No, uh, dang it. All right, hold up, hold up. I think I know what I got to do. Uh, but this will take a little bit of practice. This is so cool, though. Ugh. Oh, shoot. Ah, oh, we made it. <laughs> oh, my God. Jesus Christ. This is quite, uh, quite creepy indeed, but I love it. It's so good. It does like there's some sort of an infection that has absolutely destroyed this area. But I cannot wait to find out more and go through the uh, story some more. Oh, what the heck? Oh, I hate that guy. Oh, shoot. Oh, my gosh. That was so close. <laughs> Woo. Okay. 
Oh my. Ah, oh, so lucky. I was so lucky there. Almost had me. Alright. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna have to keep on pushing this. But for that, I gotta activate this. There we go. And now I keep on bringing it over. I hope I can find all the pages, all the missing pages in every single one of the chapters because uh, I do want to give myself... Ooh, and I see the dude that's about to give me uh, maybe another chest or something. Let me just get rid of this worm first. There we go. I may have to push this again. But first, I am going to have to, of course, bring this guy another page. Oh my gosh, I don't like that at all. Hey, listen to that. And I did find it. Awesome. All right. Hmm. This does look like it's going to be kind of like a boss battle or something, but first I'm probably going to have to bring that dude, the, um... The page! Oh, God. What? Huh. Interesting. I'm pretty sure that from this one you cannot really jump and climb higher. Oh, maybe I can use the wings? No, you cannot. Ah, oh, man, but the animations, though, and the mechanics is just super, super cool. Look at this thing. So cool. Yeah, probably gonna have to activate something at the top first, and then I'm gonna have to come back here and figure it out. So first of all, let me give this dude the pages, because we have all of them. Hey, bud. I got all. Here is the union between the Courageous protagonist and his chronicler. Antar, the story of yours becomes more and more exciting. Sometimes I can't find the words to describe such a waste of audacity. Thanks for bringing me all the missing pages. The chest is open. Now you can take its contents. I have a feeling this uh, narrator here is actually the old man. An impeccable whisper can be heard inside the ember. Groovy. Hmm. Collect the fossil fossilized earthworm in the human uh, or whatever that name was, in the cave. In the hunter's cave, I want to say. Jump! There we go. Activate this. And now we should be able to keep on pushing this. Because I'm pretty sure the lever here did not activate the one at the bottom. We gotta do something else with the other one at the bottom. And I think that will be maybe pushing this heavy here. It's gonna break it. Or that. Never mind. Okay, uh, and I think I actually need this. Yep, yep, yep. I think I know what I gotta do. The other one is broken, so I'm gonna need this one here to jump on. Uh, I gotta do this. This. This, and this. Hey, we got it. There we go. That is awesome. Man, this is such a special game. And I think I just made my way to the next chapter. Yep, definitely did. And I'm pretty sure we're probably gonna still need this. Not sure. I don't know. Let's go. Let's get it with us. Let's see uh, what's gonna be on the other side. Oh, never mind. We're doing it. Okay, we're good. Oh, God. I do not like this at all. What the heck? So many corpses. Apparently the giant worms ended up devouring Nento and his entire group of hunters. It is unfortunate that so many lives have been lost because of the crazy ideas of the madman. What the heck? Oh my god, the way those lights turned off as I walked by? That is so cool. Wait, what? Did I just go to sleep? Didn't you tell me that you wanted to control another protagonist? Well, it seems that today is your lucky day, little brother. 
You're crazy. Are you waiting for our uncle to punish us because of you? Just look at him. The, old, the poor old man has fallen asleep again in the middle of his own story. We could try it and then go back to the boring story of Enter. If you don't open your big mouth, no one has to know anything. I don't know, Len. There are rules for something. Do you really think our uncle never broke any rules when he was young? Perhaps that is precisely what uh, storytelling is all about. Being able to make your own decisions and still conclude the story in the right way? Something like a test? Exactly. Maybe our uncle will be so impressed with us that he will end up turning into he will end up turning us into narrators when he wakes up. Oh, what the heck is happening? Is this then kind of like controlling a different type of narrator? And is that thing kind of like my health at the top of my head? I think it is. Oh, we can also do battle and everything? Are you kidding me, game? What the heck? Yes, we can do battle. And I think by doing that, I'm healing my character. Look at that. Now he's fully healed. He doesn't have his head on the chest. Uh, meaning that he's probably... Yeah, he's all good. What? This is crazy. This game is actually uh, better and better the way you go. Not to mention the art style. Stupid beast! You should have killed me when you had a chance! Now, I will finish you. Oh my god! Oh gosh! <laughs> Get out of here! Get it! Oh no, 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 I do not like this. Oh no! Dang it! Did not expect him to slide there. Get him! Okay, this is pretty easy so far. But keep in mind, this is our first battle. Of course, it had to be a little bit easier. There we go. Jesus Christ. But this game is gorgeous, though. I'm loving the animations. It's done. Nothing else keeps me here. It's time to end the story forever. What? What is even happening? Oh, what the heck? No, 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 no. How could this have happened? What else can we do now? I'm so sorry, brother. But I think that decision is no longer in our hands. Do you think he would be able to force us to do something like that? The heck? Oh, I don't know what happened, but this that is no good. Len! A rainbow! Explain this mess explain this mess to me right away. It's my brother's fault. He was the one who got the idea of another protagonist because he found Antar to be boring. Liar, you were the one who insisted we break the rules. I never would have woken up Nento if he hadn't asked me to. Nento, are you telling me that you broke the rules? Please tell me that you didn't dare to start a narrative with a character other than Antar. We thought nothing was going to happen. Uncle, really, I, I didn't want to. Damn fools. Do you even understand the magnitude of the blunder you have just made? Because of you, we are now forced to deal with a protagonist that we do not have control of and who will try in each narration uh, to reach the end of the story to conclude it. Better get ready. We must head towards the smiling island before it's too late for us. Are you kidding me? Weird. I could have sworn that this place was covered in dead bodies. Oh, I think they actually changed the, uh, the narrative. Are you kidding me? I've seen kind of like a map on the back there. But I don't know what else has changed right here. Yeah, this place definitely doesn't have any more dead bodies or anything like that. So I think maybe they kind of like turn back time or something like that. Don't really know. I really, really have no idea what has happened. But you know what, guys? I think this is going to be the end of the first epi episode of Saviorless. Uh, this is a very, very special adventure. Uh, I had no idea it's going to be this good. Uh, I only, as I was saying before I started playing this game, I kind of like see a little bit of uh, how the game looks and how the game feels. But I didn't really want to get too much into it as I did not want to kind of like uh, ruin the, uh, the adventure for myself. But I'm actually quite impressed with this. And uh, I cannot wait to come back at it a little bit later on. But until next time, guys. 
Thank you very much for watching. If you guys enjoyed this and want to grab game for yourselves, link is down below in the description. Make sure you leave a like as well. That way you're down there. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.